Hey, 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 greetings from California. We are in Lebec, California. 101 Highway goes back there into LA on that side. That way to San Francisco. Last night we stayed at Motel 6 down there. The traffic was really heavy due to a large wildfire. The highway was closed yesterday. So all this area here, this here is a truck stop. Fills up with trucks. And the highway was so full of trucks, it was just crazy. So we said, you know, let's spend the night here. And today we drive towards Los Angeles, California. And we found this little food truck. We had some tacos here last night. They were pretty decent. And this whole area here fills with these big trucks. That's where they come to rest for the night. You know, the guys who sleep in the trucks and they eat here, the tacos and tortas, burritos. And we saw that they make breakfast. So we said, hey, let's go have some street food. Let's have some breakfast because nothing better than breakfast and nothing better than street food. So this is Lebec, California. Beautiful, beautiful here. Look at these hills. Look, they got houses up there on the hills. Way up there, look. It would be nice to be living up there and you can look down on the town below. It's a small little place. Tacos Jimenez. Tacos Jimenez, check it out. That's a place to eat here. It's located on Fraser Mountain Park Road and the corner of Ralph's Ranch Road. In case you ever get to Lebec, California, and the Motel 6, prices are much better than a lot of other places. A pretty little town, they got a liquor store, out of body, AM, PM. They have a Wendy's back there and a Flying J gas station. Also sells food. Oh, Flying J is over there, see? Another gas station there, Jack in the Box. But you know us, street food. Street food is the way to go. Oh, that's Taco Venice number two, so maybe, maybe they got number one also. Oh, back there's a restaurant too. I can't see what it says. Restaurant Pinoy? Does it say Pinoy? Pinos. Los Pinos, yeah. That makes more sense. Los Pinos. There you can see the sign. Oh, it's the number five. Number five going to Los Angeles. I use Google Maps, so I just follow the map where it goes. But this is it. Lebec, California. Here at the truck stop, having some street food for breakfast. I'll show you what the food is like as soon as it's ready. We ordered already chorizo with eggs and I think it'll be good. And I'm rocking my Chiapas hat because it's hot. They say it's gonna get up to 115 degrees today. But traffic is flow flowing normal again. But um, that wildfire, they had a wildfire in that direction. Maybe we'll drive past it. Over 5,200 acres destroyed. Just like that. So I'll see you as soon as the food gets here, guys. Here in Lebec, California. Here we are waiting on our breakfast. The sun is hot, look at that. But there's a nice breeze blowing. It's at least 110. I yeah, think. it's like 110 right now. They said it's going to go all the way to 115. Yeah. So we have to keep hydrated, guys. Yeah, drink lots of water. I quit drinking Coca-Cola. It's been five days. Gotta get rid of this big gut. Five days? Yeah, five days. Feels like five months. See? It's been rough. Yeah. Okay, our breakfast is ready. Food has arrived and it looks good. We got chorizo, 
with eggs, rice, and they have some refried beans. And their trademark here, whatever food you buy, you get a fried tortilla with refried beans. That's like a trademark of them. They do that. We had tacos last night here. Same thing, we got the fried tortilla with beans. That's just what they do for everybody. Where are you, Maria? Got the same? You too, que conseguiste? So she got eggs with ham and also has, Oh, yeah, and fresh tortillas here. Fresh, fresh. Hot. And her eggs with ham comes also with rice and with the beans. And tenía la tortilla también? And I also had the tortilla, which is the trademark here of Tacos Jimenez here in Quebec. Quebec? Quebec, se llama aquí? Quebec. Quebec. Quebec, 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 California. $42. 42 bucks. For two waters two. and three breakfasts. Three breakfasts, two waters, 42 bucks. USA money. Calculated into whatever country you watch them from and then you'll know not too cheap but hey and they, gotta give eat. Us, they give us food like for truckers because this is a trucker stop look 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 how much food look at this so yeah. much food and all these tortillas these are boiling hot look i will open it for you guys see they're really hot <laughs> yeah they know truckers are hungry yeah so so they they get the beetles like a trucker. Yeah, they get a good meal. Well, let me give it a try, and let me so you know what it's like. First, woo, it's windy. Oh, the wind is so good in this heat. First, I'm gonna try the eggs with chorizo. They say it's a little spicy. I like it spicy. Is spicy. Oh, it's good. Now I'll try the rice. I'm not much of a rice eater, but I'll give it a try. Very good juice. Yeah, yeah, we're getting dust on us now. And there's the refried beans. Also, quite, quite good. So, I'm gonna have this meal now. Here in Lebec, California, here at Tacos Jimenez. Truck stop, look at that. Yesterday, this place was, there were so many trucks here. There must have been 50, 60 trucks just lined up. All of, the, all of them had the engines, engines running. It was really loud, which was like, from all the engines. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a bit. I'm going to eat now. Can you get me a fork? Well, we had a great breakfast here. At the Taco Jimenez, guys, here at the truck stop. As you can see, trucks are starting to pile up. We're getting a few already. There's a guy there in a blue car. He's screaming, holy high hell. I don't know what. <clears throat> He's mad at something. Small little place. Very pretty. It's 110 degrees. But the breeze is blowing, so it's really not that bad. If the breeze would be blowing, oh yeah, it'd be rough. There goes the truck already. Off to Mexico. Bye-bye. Off to Mexico or somewhere in the United States. What a cool thing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And... See you next time. <laughs> guy, guy there is really mad. He is swearing. I found a cool little statue here. Let me go take a look. I wonder what it is. Some kind of bird. Looks like a... Is it a vulture? Or is it a condor? I think, I think it's a vulture. But they got this little here at the entrance to the town. This little area. Really nice. Oh, back there is the Motel 6. Where we were staying. And there you can see the taco truck. Taco breakfast. They're here from early in the morning. 
Late at night we were here, they were still here. They got a good little deal going. Look at the beautiful scenery here. It's just amazing. I love it. Look, house way up on top there. I like those houses up there. The views would really be something. See, chains required in the winter because we're up high. We are up high in the mountains and it gets slippery when it's getting icy. So let me go pay for the meal. Everybody else is in the truck already. I will pay for the meal. And off towards Los Angeles, California, guys. Thanks for watching the video. Until next time, bye-bye. Hey, I met this guy here at the restaurant. Como se llama? Carlos. This is Carlos. And they have this boot company. And he was here at the restaurant having breakfast also. So he's gonna show he's gonna show what the boots look like. I wanna see. You wanna see the boots? Yeah. So he says they manufacture these boots in Mexico and then they import them to the United States. So you see the names there. Check them out. He says he has a big TikTok. He has a big TikTok account. So you can see more of his stuff on TikTok. That, that's him right there. That's him right there. All right. Oh, yeah. Uh, that's his brand down there. And these are the boots that he makes, made in Mexico. Wow. Look at this. Nice. Nice, nice boots. Only that you go wrong. Yeah. Nice, nice boots. Guys. Nice. From Carlos's factory. Yes. Yeah, ¿Qué parte de México? León. León. León, Guanajuato. And so good. All pure leather. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Wow. ¿Y en cuánto sale una de estas? 144 dólares. 144 dollars. 144 bucks US. Oh, that is. boot like this. ¿Y de mujeres? Yeah. Oh, and he sells hats too? Wow, qué bonito. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, those are Stetson hats. He, buy, he buys them and resells them. Okay. ¿Y eso cuánto sale? Esta 395. ¿Dólares o? Dólares. 395 dollars for a Stetson hat like that. And these cool boots. This is the brand there. He has an online store called Botines Charros. I'll leave a link. I'll leave a link in the description. Check him out. You can buy your boots there right from him online. Look at that, guys. Yeah. Look at that. Look. Yeah, good quality. Yeah. Very good quality stuff. Yeah. Yeah, look. Viva Mexico. Viva Mexico, guys. Viva. Wow. Un camino en tu vida. Buy your boots. Hecho en México. Nice. Beautiful. Genuine. Made in Mexico boots. Trece. 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 Yeah, yeah. They even have 13. All the way up to size 13. So that's good to know. Yeah. So we can buy them online. You can buy them online. Nosotros vimos en Canadá las mandas para allá. Yeah. Ah, pues que acá. Yeah. Ah, okay. Oh. Uh -huh. business card? Para no tengo, no okay. Ah. okay. Para que así voy a poner en mi, en mi video. Okay. So that's it, guys. Here from Lebec, California. Carlos here. He is importing his boots from Mexico. Stopped. We are lucky to meet him here at the little taco breakfast stand. Here comes some more horse trailer or something. Very cool. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. See ya. Bye bye.